Guys, this is the beginning of this little like, little baby tree. Morning's come, you watch the red sunrise. The LED still flickers in your eyes. All oh, you are to spare to face the razor. Because no one's gonna spare the time for you. From a house you didn't build and can't control Oh, you ought to spare your face the razor Because no one's gonna spare So look at this guys, we have a root It's pretty cool It's the only one But yeah, none of the other ones Seem to have Woohoo, I guess Put it so the root's kind of pointing down. Oh, hmm. Maybe that's a little deep. I don't know. Ah, it should be fine. Okay. Oh, look at this, guys. We got two more. Now, this one was up here in the kind of. It looks like it's maybe rotted a bit. I don't know, something, something bad going on. So, the root looks to have uh, gone a little bit of some kind of rot or something already. So, that one might not be much of a go, but I'll plant it anyway. And then this one looks really nice and healthy. Right there. Looking good, and you can already see these things like the the stems when the when the root gets out of there and the plant starts to shoot up. They're really red, you know, redwoods. Sorry, the name comes from. So you can already see that a little bit there. All right, so that's two more. Getting better. I was, I was starting to think there's only going to be one in thirty. But yeah, two more. That's good. Good start. Maybe we'll get a couple more in the next few days. Alright guys, I think we got another one, where is it, yeah, I think it's the only one, this one right here, this is uh, two days after the last one, so I think that brings our total, oh, <laughs> where am I, yeah, total germinated seeds now to, whoops, come on flip over, ah, So that brings the total of germinated seeds to, let's see, one, two, three, this will be number four, so, okay, none of the other ones are showing any signs of sprouting up yet, but I mean, the roots are only just poking out, so I'm sure it will be a while, and none of these ones, I just planted the uh, seeds during the dirt, they haven't shown any signs, but I planted those deep, they were like an inch deep, so. If they are germinating, it'll be a while. But yeah, all right. Oh wait. So it's time for an update on the uh, on the old redwoods, the sequoias, giant sequoias. It's been like I don't know, two weeks maybe. Let's see what we have here. All right, guys. So here we are. So to start with, look at this, we got one, two, three, four, five, six seeds that have definitely germinated. Uh, there are different stages of kind of popping out of the dirt. This one I'd literally just planted so you can't see anything. Um, this one. It's actually pretty close to the surface. You can see that it is shooting out, but there's no, uh, I guess, hasn't hasn't poked above the soil yet. And this one just came out today, and I just actually pulled the uh, 
kind of seed casing off of it. So that's why it looks a bit funky. It hasn't really turned green yet. But it's, it's in good shape. It should be probably looking like one of these other ones by the end of the day. Um, there's another one that hasn't hasn't come up yet. And then here we have the two best ones. This one's been out the longest. It was the first one to shoot. So you know, it's almost an inch tall already. <laughs> no. It's got a long way to go yet, but it's a start. Um, yeah, and you can see, nice and red. And, uh, and then this one might actually be a little bit taller, but it's uh, yeah, it's bit, it's about a day day behind this one, so that's why the uh, leaves, I guess. Do you call, do you call them leaves? Are they needles? It doesn't really matter if the green parts have not spread out as much yet, not quite as big, but this one does seem to be taller, so that's interesting. So yeah, have here, um, so this I planted this one on the 16th of July. Um, Let me see what the date is today. Okay, so today is the 23rd of July. Then all these other ones are just kind of variously after. I'm pretty sure this was the first one germinated seed to go in. And then that's why I put a date on it. And then the rest of them are just like staggered over the next. Just, it's been about one one a day for at least the last week. Um, yeah, maybe one every two days on average. So, um, yeah, the 23rd. And, uh,. Yeah, I mean, this is where they're at right now. So I have, so that's cool. You know, I can have at least six by the looks of things. And these ones that we planted here, I have pretty sure absolutely no sign of growth. Yeah, I might. Probably gonna dig down on one of these to see if the seeds have germinated in there at all because I know I buried them quite deep, so it's gonna take a while for them to come up. Anyway, like you know, they have germinated, yeah. It's just... Ah, I found one seed. And it would appear it's done absolutely nothing. So that one hasn't germinated. Um, there's another seed. And... No, nothing. No sign of germination. No, oh, and I dropped it. They do. Oh, I don't know. They they do look a lot healthier than the the ones that haven't germinated in the uh, in the paper towel. But I don't know, maybe it just wasn't really kind of moist enough or something. I don't know. But yeah, so it wouldn't appear that any of those have germinated yet. Um, just gonna assume it's the same in these ones, but I'll wrap them back up and leave them for a little while, I guess. Like, I suppose that means we've learnt that the paper towel method is still the winner. Oh, oh no. Um, so yeah, as I think that's kind of what I predicted at the beginning. But it was just, you know, if you look online, everyone's talking about the, you know, how they're so hard to germinate. And you got to do, you know, this and this, and you know, chill them for for months before you try and germinate them, and then you know, plant them in the dirt and whatever. But you know, good old paper towel. They grew pretty damn well. That's 
So that's 6 out of 30 right now. It's not amazing odds, but, um, you know, it's, it's not bad. It just amazes me that this thing can grow for, like, you know, this could potentially, like, you know, plant it somewhere good and it's lucky it could still be here 3,000 years from now. I'll be so long gone that you know, no one will remember I even existed, but this tree could still be here. I think that's just absolutely amazing.